Hello and welcome back to another video here at Heligar YouTube. I'm G and in today's video I'll be answering the all important questions surrounding the Mavic Air 2 not coming with AirSense. This has been a topic of a large debate and has come under some scrutiny from the drone community. So let's dive in and go through the following topics. What is AirSense? Why only North American versions of the Mavic Air 2 come with AirSense? How crucial AirSense really is? And will future Mavic Air 2 models come with AirSense? DJI AirSense is an alert system that uses ADS-B signals from nearby airplanes and helicopters to warn drone pilots if they appear to be on a collision course. AirSense increases situational awareness for drone pilots, informing them about airplanes or helicopters in the area. And part of DJI's commitment to enhance drone safety and improve airspace harmony between manned and unmanned aviation, it can detect airplanes and helicopters from miles away, farther than a drone pilot can see or hear them. It also displays their location on the screen of the drone pilot's remote controller. However, it has to be noted that it will not stop you from colliding into another DJI drone, as neither drones send out a signal to be detected. Up next is why only North American versions of the Mavic Air 2 come with AirSense. This is such a short answer for a very demanding question, however we don't have enough information to give you a holistic view. Drone manufacturers simply said, supply chain shortages related to the coronavirus pandemic have caused only North American versions of Mavic Air 2s to come with AirSense. For more in-depth reasons, you can see them on our blogs about the Mavic Air 2. The link is in the description below. Moving on to how crucial AirSense is. Okay, so for the average flyer of the Mavic Air 2, it is not a deal breaker, and here's why. The Mavic Air 2 is aimed primarily at a recreational flyer. Hobbyists and content creators wishing to capture stunning landscape or an amazing bit of footage. Your typical Mavic Air 2 operator will not be flying under special permissions granted by a PFCO. So they will be bound by strict regulations which are there to ensure the safe flights of drone pilots and to avoid collisions with manned aviation. New rules state that drones cannot be flown within a 5km by 1km zone at the end of an airport runway or within 2 or 2.5 nautical miles of an airport. Both of these zones extend upwards to the height of 2,000 feet above the airfield. In a nutshell, as long as you stick to laws and you aren't a commercial pilot with a special permission, you really shouldn't need AirSense when operating your Mavic Air 2. And finally, will future Mavic Air 2 models come with AirSense? Unfortunately, there is no current information that we can get from DJI about the future batches. Everything is kind of under wraps at the minute and not a lot of information is being released. So if you managed to get some information that we don't know about, be sure to comment it in the comment section below and help fill in all these missing blanks. Thank you for watching today's video and I'll catch you in the next one.